is Scott Axelson, and I'm the Vice President of Tradepec Los Angeles, uh, which means I'm nominally in charge of the efficiency and operations here at Tradepec Los Angeles facility. What have we ordered to date from Calmar? Uh, it includes a, a software and hardware, 29 total ASCs, uh, 27 of which are their uh, standard model, and two of which are their newest fifth generation ASCs. In addition, we've ordered 28 straddle carriers and a full suite of applications called TLS, uh, which uh, governs uh, and executes all of the automated moves after taking orders from the terminal operating system. The biggest challenge right now facing Tradepak is to run an automated operation with a traditional operation while we're doing the development because we were not a greenfield site. We decided on a combination of automated stacking cranes or ASCs and automated straddle carriers, uh, primarily due to the configuration. We have a very uh, non-traditional, odd-shaped, uh, non-rectangular layout. And uh, so we needed to uh, introduce the auto strats more than just the horizontal transport to and from the ship to the ASCs, but also to and from the ship to the uh, intermodal on-dock rail cranes. And they allowed us not only to transport them and decouple the moves uh, from the vessel, but also to uh, provide some density in that kind of environment. The main benefit of combining the automated straddle carriers and the automated stacking cranes is to get to that level of 10,000 TEUs per acre, which is among the highest in the world and far outstrips anything that's currently experienced on the U.S. West Coast. We're just starting to introduce the automated truck handling or ATH feature. And basically what that does is it allows us to land the containers automatically and make it a 100% uh, automated transaction. And what this allows us to do is to do multiple transactions at one time in the most safe and efficient manner possible. Integration in this type of product is absolutely the most daunting task to overcome. We mitigated it by A, choosing uh, one vendor to handle all the aspects, and that was Calmar. Secondly, we spent the first six months, many hours, many days, trying to uh, specify all of the messages, protocols, and interactions and expectations that we were gonna have between us. Once we had put that in a written document and performed the applications, it was test, test, test again. Now that we're in live operation, the challenge is A, uh, optimizing those operations to increase the throughput while uh, developing the future phases uh, two through five. And again, all this while we're running both an automated operation and traditional operation. So we work very closely with Calmar to make sure that what we do is replicatable and it will go into the next phase of operation. Our partnership with Calmar has led to uh, the development of the fifth generation ASC, which is lighter, uh, uses less energy, uh, requires less maintenance, commissions faster, uh, integrates faster, and is uh, kind of represents all the lessons learned that we've done through the first phase. And so uh, we're very excited about this new crane and can't wait to get it into production.